Why do I look so white? Big boob. <laughs> Here we have a great photo of Alicia's ass. It's fat. Good morning everybody, so it is currently 1am, um, I have to drive to Miami because my first shoot of this week is at, I have to be there at 4.30 for makeup and Orlando and Miami is like three and a half hours away so I am leaving now and then right after it I have another shoot with Jitty. I have to do um, a campaign shot for them. On Tuesday I have another shoot. Wednesday have a facial, but I know you guys like to see like a daily vlog, so I'm bringing you guys along for that. Are those being crackhead? I'm sure. Hey, right now I have my waist trainer on because Victor convinced me to go eat freaking vaca frita last night. Well, yesterday ish, and I gained four pounds overnight. So, gonna have my Orphic Nutrition healthy weight management pills and my probiotics. Hopefully, I can shit this all out by the time I have to go shoot. Alrighty, we are on the way. It is literally 1.32, so I'm already running behind schedule. I have to stop and get gas, and then fucking the speed race. <laughs> I have literally exactly, like, not even really three hours to get there, so... So I don't get a ticket, because I'm late. Why is the camera not focusing? Hello? Okay, got finished with makeup, I literally look like all my features look super dark that's just how makeup is like like when you're shooting all your makeup is like 10 times darker than it normally would be just because stuff doesn't really show up on camera so it kind of looks a little crazy sometimes in person i got here a little late right now the makeup artist is doing another girl's makeup i didn't want to record like in the car because we do makeup in the car because that way like it saves time instead of having to like um do makeup in a studio and then drive to where we're gonna shoot we just do makeup in the car like where we're shooting at so this is one of my second time shooting with this company and i didn't really know the makeup artist that well so of course i don't want to be like shoving a camera in her face and being like hey say hi to my youtube channel you know i'm like waiting for the photographer to get here super humid out so i hairsprayed the shit out of my hair i look so white why do i look so white maybe it's the pic the light okay you know what, I'm gonna stop looking at myself. Wait, that's your vlog? Yeah. Is that guy that was asking for a contact? No, she's the one with my contact. Yeah, hold on. Like, <laughs> <laughs>
the drugstore, you were picking up your prescription. It's funny 'cause I got addicted to you when we were in love, and even though you broke it off, I struggle with it like you were a bottle of pills. I wish I could give in to my dependency. <laughs> I look like a total crackhead. Um, we just finished shooting, so I'm late to get to my next shoot right now, unfortunately. Um, Turn right onto Fifth Street. I'm actually gonna be like 15 minutes late, which is kind of bad because they were waiting for me to do makeup. So, oh my God, my thing is all messed up. But uh, I am on my way. They are gonna touch up my makeup, hopefully, because I look a little crazy. Wrapped up shooting with Hot Miami Styles. I literally love shooting with them. Like the energy and everybody there is just so good. Like everyone's so sweet. They're so nice. Literally my favorites. Time to get this bread. everybody I know that I just like disappeared last night and that's because I got home around like three o'clock after that shoot I didn't film a lot of that shoot because um, I was really not feeling well like I hadn't had water all day so I took a nap like before I left so I woke up around like one o'clock I left from Orlando to Miami to be at a shoot turn right onto Southwest 30th Street to be at a shoot at 4 30 I shot there till like 10 I finished around 10 I rushed there to go to another shoot obviously you guys know this I'm talking about this like it's been an entirely different day to you guys it's the same video I'm so stupid so we were shooting at a park and I hadn't eaten and I hadn't had water since the day before speaking of I didn't bring water with me this time either Ugh. so I was like super dehydrated I didn't have any nutrition in my body I was really starting to feel super weak like I wasn't feeling good and I just wasn't like in a good headspace and at that point it was just like okay I need to get these shots in and just go like I so turn left onto southwest 178th I didn't want to be there like I was really upset and I didn't want to be like pissy on the camera or anything so we finished around like 2 30 and then I drove home and I was gonna take a nap and then my nap oh shit my nap ended up being like like I literally fell asleep at 3 and I didn't wake up till 3 a.m. it was super bad so today I am going to another shoot uh, my hair is wet because i didn't finish drying it i brought my blow dryer i'll just dry it there today we're doing literally just catalog shots so it's pretty simple like nothing too crazy i made sure to look cute today you know so yeah girl <laughs> Brothers, when day we gon' make it? We just gotta grind for that paycheck. I'ma tell me one day I'll be famous. Remember when she used to say she hate this? That ended with life when I say shit.
the head. E. <gasps> oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's me. Can I zoom in? Is there right. It's zooming from the on the top. Oh, okay, I'm learning here. Steph! This is where you play the soft music. <laughs> Okay, sis. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling. I'm feeling myself. Besame. 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 Yes, girl. Chaz. Here we have a great photo of Alicia's ass. Looks fat. <laughs> Hi everyone! Yes, please. Por favor. What are you to the left? Derecha. 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 Myself, I wouldn't. Why do I even try? Here we go again, fucking on my head, staying home and getting stoned instead. I know that I shouldn't, I can't prioritize. I keep messing up things, I keep overthinking, following my instincts, but they're all wrong. I can't stop this cycle, making me go psycho. to go get my facial with Lisa. Um, I'm really, really excited because it's been a month since I've gotten a facial. We always face them out four weeks in between and I'm starting to get like a lot of little pimples on my face, like a lot of inflammation right here. I think it's from that day that I wore my makeup for shooting like so long, like I had makeup on from 4 a.m. to 3 o'clock in the afternoon and it just sat for a really long time. And then also yesterday, um, I had makeup done at 9 and then I didn't take it off till 7 o'clock so it was on for a while not because I just wanted to keep the makeup on but because I had to like I had to shoot all the way till 5 30 and then I had a meeting at 6 30 and then the meeting didn't finish till like 7 30 so I obviously didn't want to go into a meeting looking like this so I left the makeup on and I think that's what like really caused me to have all these breakouts 
So anyway, I'm gonna go to sis. I'm gonna bring you guys along so you guys can see her. She's literally like, see her, well, meet her. She's literally like the nicest person ever. I seriously love her and she's helped my skin so much. This side of my face is literally clearing up a whole lot. This side is like almost all my really, really dark marks are gone off there. She's in the Hollywood area of South Florida, so if you are in the South Florida area, I 100% suggest her. She's actually super affordable and amazing at her, her job. And like, she literally makes you feel so comfortable right away. This is only my third session with her, I'm pretty sure. And I just love her. Like, I literally cannot wait to see her when it's time to go. So, I think I'm going to go have brunch, really breakfast lunch with Andre and Mia I'm waiting to see um, we're probably gonna go to this cute little restaurant called the little hen I'm gonna see if they want to go the little hen bro has the best croissants ever I'm trying to have me an omelet again that shit was so good oh my god I literally have dreams about that food I could change into this because that's what she likes me to change into. I am so ready for this. You it's know, been long no, enough. Huh? I feel like it's been so long. So, from since looking at your skin from up here, mm -hmm. you have a nice glow. Yeah. Here. It's doing good. Yeah, you're doing good. It's a nice glow. Yeah, I noticed no more like big congestion here anymore. Right. That's pretty much gone away. You're nice and you're hydrated. Yeah, I've been doing, I've been using the aloe a lot. Very good. But I just had my period like a couple, like maybe last week, so I had a few breakouts from that, like on my chin and stuff. Which is normal. Which is normal. But overall, you look good. You look nice and bright. Everything yes. looks less pigmented than it did before. Yay! We are Girl, getting I've been, there. I've been counting down. <laughs> I'm like, I'm so excited. I tried the rosehip oil and it broke me out too. Oh no! Yeah. Your skin is so sensitive. <laughs> so I have like a handful of clients that like everything is like, oh this, this. I'm like, yeah. okay, look. Yeah. If it broke you out and it's yeah. causing problems, we're not gonna use it. I just finished my facial with her. My skin feels so much better. I had a few like, she said, um, like oil trap little like pimples on my chin and stuff. And so she got rid of all of those. My face feels so much better. Like I love leaving from her because I feel so clean. I count down the days to these appointments. I'm so happy when I get ready to come in for facials. I am gonna attach a photo of like my before and after with her. It's only been my third facial with her, you guys. And literally, the difference just like blows my mind like this woman has literally changed my life if you guys have been following me for a while you know how much i've struggled with skincare how bad my skin has been like i literally had points where my skin was hurting so bad i was crying like wow i'm just like shook so she told me probably within a year we could like totally clear up my face so i'm really, really excited because i was thinking like two years but she told me like just a year so and already like how much difference that we've made with just three facials is insane and um she told me like we're gonna go like another six months with doing like home care and facials and all that kind of stuff and then we'll move into chemical peels but my skin is really really sensitive and even with some of the things that she suggested to me like i can't use them so we're just like learning as we go we might do chemical peels we might not just because my skin is so sensitive like rosehip oil like she told me that was like awesome for scars and my skin literally hated it um the sunscreen she gave me too like my skin didn't like it as well so my skin is just really sensitive but so far like she's the only person I've had that's ever managed to handle my skin and like literally see drastic noticeable results even coming from me because I'm like the most impatient person ever and I like literally never know those results <laughs> but she's so good so if you are in the Hollywood South Florida area and you're trying to get a facial I swear to you this is the best best esthetician you will ever find i'm like so thankful i found her. mia is not going to be going to breakfast so it's just going to be andre and i because mia decided that she wanted to go get a job at hooters and 
yeah, she's just not coming. Anyway, oh yeah. And um, if you guys haven't seen the Diva Girl video that I uploaded, it's like popping off and going huge. I think right now it has 11,491 views and it just like all of a sudden blew up from like 2K this morning to that. So I'm obviously getting all of these like, you know, comments from people that think they know everything and then, you know, I'm getting some nice comments from you guys and it's really unfortunate um, that a lot of other people have been experiencing this as well. But if you haven't seen that video, I will leave it in the description box down below so you guys can Hello, check it out. Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. We're all here. These two were not supposed to come, but now they're here. We're all here. Yeah, Shit. Uh, fake titties and everything. <laughs> Big boob. Dude, those things look huge. I know, this, this has gone on for generations, this uh, yeah. bombshell. Oh it's gone to like Your boobs years. are bigger than mine. That's insane. Th they don't even fill out though. It's like, I have to like... Do doesn't out. that hurt? Oh, huh. it's, it's fake. Fingers eating for mm -hmm. My mouth eating. Mm -hmm. They eating too. <laughs> Dessert! Um, we just finished having lunch. It is way later than I thought I was going to end up leaving. It's actually 6.18 right now. So I'm going home, I'm going to pack, and I am headed back home. Um, so that is going to be the end of this vlog. I feel like I really need to get better about vlogging. If you guys would like to see more vlogs like this, I'm sure I'll get better as time goes on. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up as well as to subscribe and hit that little bell button so you are always notified when I upload. Yeah, I'm kind of tired and not looking forward to this three hour drive, but if I leave now, that means I should get home around like 10 o'clock, start working on other stuff, so yeah. I love you guys and I will see you next time. Bye. Making money like a mint. Laying in my eyes like shrimp, like shrimp, like shrimp. Making it shine.